Well, good morning. It's 8.52. This is June the 16th. I didn't brush my hair. Mariah did not brush your hair. I look like this. So, uh, taking her dog to the groomers. Maybe they'll do my hair while we're there. That's okay. <laughs> we, um, we have a lot to do today. Uh, yesterday I had two jobs to do, but I had some breakdowns and it turned into a maintenance day. Which is okay, I needed a maintenance day. Uh, it just pushes us for the rest of the week. People keep calling, wanting us to, to work, and I passed three on to her brother yesterday, and he probably, he's not even answering his phone, so he probably didn't want him either. We don't have any more time for any more work. We don't want no more. <laughs> we are full up. Everybody out here, I looked on Facebook, and man, there are so many cheap mowers for sale right now, where people is dropping, people dropping these lawns like flies. They, um, these people that bid cheap and hogging them all up at the beginning of the season, they're now losing them. And when we go to give a quote, people act like we're holding the daggone knife to their throat because they really have no choice. It's my way or no way. That's weird. I mean, we just. We just can't take on anymore. So when we do take one on, it's going to be profitable. Oh, do me a favor, take a picture of this and send it to Wes. I forgot my list. Okay, so um, we were going to head up to Knoxville. We're going to put that off to tomorrow because one of our commercial clients, they want us to give them another bid on another section of the property. And so we're going to go tomorrow because uh, if we land this, we could possibly make a whole day's wage at one stop. And that's what I'm hoping. So today we just gone ahead and decided to stick around Maryville. I got some color fast shampoo on sale because I needed some, but smell it. Smell. Girly. Mm, so girly. Very girly. And then I got some this is on sale too. Leave in conditioner. Because I've been trying to get my hair where it's not. I'm going to grow my hair out. I always decide I'm going to grow my hair out and then end up cutting it anyhow. I always look better with shorter hair. But when I'm working, I can't pull it up out of my face. Oh, look at that long trailer. Yeah, that long trailer. Look at that. I woke up with another headache. We need to get my app going for free coffees again. You know, drink so much coffee out and about. Let me see if I can get log in. Okay, we'll see you all when we get to Wallen. Okay, Judy and I are gonna mow this first one. Then we're down here in Wallen of the 321, Wallen, Tennessee.
chilly up in the mountains. It's like 65 degrees, and on the lower the air is even colder.
Okay, I just did, just did that one and that one. Two at one stop. That's handy dandy. On to the next one. Right? Okay. <clears throat> My phone nearly went dead. Had 5%, so I had to charge it. So it's four or five yards we didn't get on here, but we're gonna go ahead and record this and. Sorry, it's DJ. Just got this yard done here, uh, here, and uh, kind of chilly out. I want to put a thought to everybody in mind. I run into one of my customers. She lost a son since the last time I've been there, and uh, she's probably eighty-four. She's eighty-three, yeah. So somewhere around there. Anyways, uh, of course she's very sad. You guys. I always let people know how much you care for them while they're alive. That way, if you lose them, not only is it just the pain of losing them, but if you don't let people know how you feel while they're alive, it will bother you. No, seriously, uh, you guys let your children know how much you care for them because I've got two customers lost children this year. So let your children know. I know me and Mariah will do anything for our kids, and they know it. Our children know. They ain't a doubt in their mind. If they need anything, especially love, in which they're never lacking from mom and dad, my children know. And everybody I get around know I have affection for them. Except Mariah. Oh, somebody found some junk, baby. Stop them picking up junk. Smart Where people. Where we're going? All right, we're going to go to Georgia's now. Okay, Judy and I now are going to do this, this trimming here. So 
Well, we're on the way to the house, 449. Mariah got her dog. Had to go to groomers. Had to get a haircut. And here, haircuts are expensive. All right, do something goofy for the video.